Thousands of migrants are still crossing the border even after President Biden issued an executive order limiting who can seek asylum. Reaction continues to pour in on this major issue months out from the November election. Fox's Connor Hansen has the latest. In other countries, we are not wanted as migrants, so they don't allow us to enter like this. Wednesday was the first full day since President Biden issued an executive order meant to reduce illegal border crossings. Hundreds of migrants from all over the world were caught on camera crossing from Mexico anyway. Customs and Border Patrol sources tell Fox News there were about 4,000 people caught crossing illegally, typical of what they've seen in recent weeks. And Fox was told more than 1,000 migrants were released in the San Diego sector alone after crossing illegally. I've come here today to do what the Republicans in Congress refuse to do, take the necessary steps to secure our border. President Biden's executive order cuts off asylum for migrants who cross illegally, but only when high numbers of people are attempting to enter the U.S. Republicans have been quick to criticize the move, calling it too little, too late. Everybody knows it. it has nothing to do with border security. And he didn't need anything from Congress. All he has to do is shut the border. You say, shut the border, sign an order, and the border will close. I did it. And some Democrats aren't happy with Biden's order either. I think it's disappointing, and, um, and I think that we really need to make sure that uh, we're actually solving the problem, which requires expanding a path to citizenship. Since President Biden took office in January of 2021, Customs and Border Patrol says they've apprehended nearly 7 million illegal immigrants. In New York, Connor Hansen, Fox News.